Hey guys, it's Emma. Today I have a hair tutorial for you guys. Today I'm using the Professional Hot Tools Spongy Rod Rollers, and you can get these at Ulta for around $10. They're really cool, and it definitely gives me this curly hair look that I'm sporting right now. And if you want to know how to do this, keep watching. What you're going to need to do is you're going to need a shower and then sleep on the curlers overnight. So I'm going to show you guys how to do that. So this is me last night. Enjoy! And I just got out of the shower and I'm going to take my hair out of the towel and kind of like go through it with my towel. Then I'm going to take my Organics Renewing Moroccan Argan Oil and you can get this at the drugstores. It's very cheap. And I'm just going to take a dime size amount and put this at the ends of my hair. Just because it is really good for your hair and makes it healthy and really soft. So, I just put this at the ends. And then I suggest that you wait 20 to 30 minutes for your hair to dry a little bit. I mean, depending on how long it takes for your hair to dry, I suggest you wait a little while till it's just like damp and not so wet um, to put the curlers in. So I'll see you guys in like 20 or 30 minutes. So I let my hair dry for about 30 minutes, and right now it's pretty damp. It's um, not all the way dry, but it's still pretty wet. So I'm going to be taking my Hot Tools Professional Spongy Rod Rollers, and it comes with 10 um, curlers, and they're actually really cool. They look like this, and they're colorful, and they're like spongy, and they bend whatever direction you want to put them in, and so they're really cool. And I'm going to show you guys how to use them. So first I'm going to make my part the way I want it. And I'm going to grab the first section, first curler, and put it underneath, and then start rolling it up. And then you bend the curlers. And it just kind of hangs like that. And then you keep going. He can read my mind. Oh, the last one I don't get my bangs because I usually just clip them back because I don't really like the way they look curled. And then I'm just going to get a bobby pin and pin those bangs back out of the way. And all the curlers are up in my hair. My hair is all covered. I actually still have two more curlers left, so really you don't need all of them, but sometimes I do use all of them, and sometimes I don't. So, yeah, I'm just going to go sleep on this, and I'll show you guys what that looks like in the morning. See you guys then. Hey guys, it's the morning, and I just did my makeup, and I got dressed. So I'm going to take my curlers out. I slept on these overnight, so they've been in for a long time. And what you do is you just take piece by piece and start unrolling them. They're going to look really tight at first, but don't let that scare you. And just keep going. And is wrapped around the bottle of rum. And she picks the strings with the tip of her thumb. She plays along because she's already losing. And the game's had I think I got all of them. So as you can tell, my bangs are still clipped up. You're just going to start pulling on them and kind of making them a little more loose and not sew together. right now but um they actually are gonna get die down and not be so crazy that's how to use the hot tools curler so for my bangs they're really crazy so i'm just gonna go ahead and straighten those with your faces in your phone you don't see me trying so as you can tell they look a lot better straightened i don't know why and with this hair i really don't like this curl so i'm just gonna clip it back it's really fun and really cute. Um, these curls die down during the day, which is a really good thing because right now they're really tight. But if you like a tight curl, then you can definitely put some hairspray on it and keep it. But I like a more looser curl, so I'm just going to let it die down. So, bye! And he doesn't know